Me and Jesus are cool. I am God. I'll whoop your ass. These disturbing comments are said by none other than the biggest star of the MMA world, Conor McGregor. He has been infamous for plenty of trash talk, fights, and arguments outside the ring, and even for attacking a fan. Please stay till the end to know about all these shocking events. Please do like, share, and subscribe. And also hit the bell icon so that you never miss any upcoming amazing content. So without further ado, let's dive into today's venture. Top 5 Disrespectful Moments of Conor McGregor Number 5. Flamboyant Man Says Trash Conor McGregor has been known to show up to press conferences dressed up in expensive suits for his MMA bouts. He's quite an attention-gaining flamboyant personality, but then comes his narcissistic behavior. His boxing bout was no different and the flamboyant Irishman took a shot at Mayweather for what he decided to wear. The Notorious, showing up in expensive clothes, gives the perception that he earns a lot of money. During a press event, he took a shot at money that is Floyd Mayweather for showing up wearing a sweatshirt to the event. He even stated that the boxing great couldn't afford a suit, for he was just a novice. He said, He's in a fucking tracksuit! He can't even afford a suit anymore! The Rolls is at 2012 outside! He also said Floyd's a total novice at fighting and said it very confidently. Number 4. McGregor Enslaved by Anger McGregor is known for his angry nature, for which he has gone through anger management classes as well. Shocking scenes of an incident went viral when McGregor and his group were seen attacking a bus carrying Khabib Nurmagomedov. This incident took place in New York in April 2018. McGregor subsequently pleaded guilty to the crime in a Brooklyn court in July 2018. As a part of the sentence, he was asked to perform five days of community service and was forced to attend anger management classes. Well, sometimes it seems Connor is not a bad man but just a man with a lack of self-control. Number 3. Who the fuck is that guy? Perhaps the most famous offensive McGregor quote of them all. McGregor was at a press conference to promote his UFC 205 fight with then lightweight champion Eddie Alvarez. When he was asked a question by a reporter, Jeremy Stevens interrupted and said he was the fighter who would give McGregor the hardest fight and was the real hardest puncher of the featherweight division. McGregor turned around to Stevens and delivered the line one more time. The press event showed that Notorious was more than comfortable and could hold his own regardless of the sport. It was one of the rare occurrences in which money, that is Floyd Mayweather, didn't really have a response and was outmatched in the verbal fight. Number 2. The Self-Declared God Me and Jesus are cool. <laughs> I'm cool with all the gods. Gods recognize gods. Said McGregor in his utmost haughty, self-absorbed and arrogant voice. UFC 196 was scheduled to be McGregor moving up to lightweight to challenge Dos Anjos in March 2016. McGregor, who showed late, delivered one newsworthy headline after another, highlighted by this statement of he considering himself a god and mocking religions and people's faiths. The fight never ended up happening because of Dos Anjos suffering an injury and being forced to withdraw. What would have been the results, you think? Number 1. McGregor attacked his own fan. This time, Notorious just crossed the limit. The Irish powerhouse has a penchant for trash talking. This has also been evident in his life outside the ring. In 2019, a video went viral where McGregor was seen snatching and smashing a fan's phone when he tried to take a selfie with the fighter. Isn't this too much arrogance on his part? Yes, one can say that fans do get mad with excitement sometimes, but this wasn't a well-deserved reaction. This event in Miami led the Irishman to be arrested. The clip went pretty viral, with the internet divided into different opinions. He was hated a lot on the internet and called an abuser but was also defended by many of his diehard fans who said that the fan deserved it. Later on, 
The charges were dropped by the court, and the matter got resolved in an out-of-court settlement. This out-of-court settlement sounds fishy, right? Of course, such settlements are a topic for another day. Well, what do you think about this? Do tell in the comment section. Hence, it seems Notorious is not learning manners anytime soon. Dana White seems to be negligent on his behavior, or just the fact that he is too famous to be kicked out. Hope his anger management classes do him some good. Hope you liked the video. Please do like, share, and subscribe, and also hit the bell icon so that you never miss any upcoming amazing content. Thanks for watching MMA Wired. We'll be right back. Till then, keep growing, keep smiling.